Laiba says, a friend of mine says, rights of human are to be more frightened for violation than the rights of Allah. And uh, um, this man becomes careless about duties towards Allah, like salah, sins, nudity. As my friend has a concept that Allah loves people so much, he will let go. This is a misconception among the people. And it is one of the deviant 72 sects that are all in hell, as the Prophet told us, alayhi Our ummah will be divided into 73. 72 of them are in hell except one. This one is one of the 72. Why? This is known as irja, and the sect is called al-murji'ah. And they claim that no matter what sins you do, as long as you believe in Allah Azza wa Jal, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala would forgive your sins. So it encourages them to fornicate, to consume intoxicants, to lie, not to pray on time, and still insist that my iman is as strong as the iman of Abu Bakr and Umar. And this is foolishness. This has nothing to do with Islam. The Prophet told us, alayhi salatu wasalam, that a woman was admitted to hell because of a kitten she kept in her house as a prisoner, captive, not feeding it and not allowing the kitten to go out and eat from the insects of the ground. So the kitten died and Allah admitted this woman to hell. Compare this to what you're doing from ignoring the salat, watching pornography, um, uh, doing haram sins, all of these things will definitely ensure you a big, good spot in hell. So when you think that Allah is most forgiving and at the same time neglect that he is severe in punishment, you're in deep trouble.